Thanks, love. I don't know why you're still here. I wouldn't give her a break. No, it's OK. I'd rather he lashed out at me. Well, it's not fair. You just can't keep an alcoholic locked up. So... Oh, what was I supposed to do? Let her keep drinking on top of her medication? She's been coping up until now. When she first got diagnosed, she handled it brilliantly. Yeah, but the situation's changed now, hasn't it? It's not the only pressure she's under. What do you mean, pressure? Is there something I don't know? No, it's just all the fallout from Vinny, love. We don't need to go back over it. Well, she can't fix things with Vinny by staying away. We've done all we can, though. Your whole family's trying to contact her and the police know she's missing. And why she's lost? You can't be lost with a phone. Yeah, but she's had a seizure. Well, if Liv has more seizures, she'll be able to recognise them coming. No, she's drunk. She'll miss all the signs. Other people will be walking past thinking she's wasted. They're not going to stop and help her. Well, I would. If I saw a girl her age in trouble, so would you, so would loads of people. Ben's right. And if she does end up in hospital, then we'll definitely find her, won't we? Because you're her next of kin. I'm just scared, all right? I'm scared that it might be too late and she needs me right now and she's laying spark out somewhere all on her own. Your sister's sharp. She's brave and resourceful when she's not on the booze. So what are you saying? You have to trust her. <laughs>